Hey everyone, Miss Ashley here, and today we are going to draw blue. And look, here is our treasure chest. Let's complete the drawing to see what's inside. Let's get started. We're going to start with blue's head. So you're going to want to start at the top left side of your paper, and we are going to draw his nose. So that'll be his nose and then the top of his head. Okay. Now let's start back here at the tip of the nose and we're gonna draw the top of his mouth. So it curves down and then back up just a little bit. It almost follows the pattern of the top line. Okay, and now let's do the bottom of his mouth. Okay, now go about midway through this line and draw a line that will connect the top and the bottom. And then the corner of his mouth has a little curved line there. Okay, so now let's draw the bottom part of his mouth, his jawline. So start here, and it will curve up and then out. So let's go back to the top and we're going to finish the top of his head. Let's see. And his head is going to come around. And curve in just a little bit. Now let's draw his teeth. His teeth are like little triangles. And then we're going to draw teeth on the bottom. on top of this line. All right, that looks good. Next, let's draw his eye. So you see where we made our little backward C curve right there? Let's go right above that and that's where his eye is gonna go. And I'm gonna give him a big circle for an eye. And inside of that, we're gonna draw a smaller circle, and then an even smaller circle for the highlight. And let's give him a little nose. Okay. So next, let's draw his back. I'm going to start here at the bottom of his neck and his back kind of curves up a little bit and whoops doesn't curve that much and down to draw his, the rest of his neck and his belly. We're gonna start under his jaw and I gave my blue a little bit of a big belly. 
And notice how these two lines are not connected. We want to keep them separate. Right. Now let's draw his tail. So come up to the top of his body, right here where it starts arching down. And we're going to draw a line out and then make it curve. And your paper might be a little bit longer than mine, so you can make his tail go out straight if you want. Now I'm going to come down and draw the bottom part of his tail. And close it. Okay, next let's draw his back legs. I'm going to make this line come down just a little bit more. Because I don't want his legs to run into his tail. Okay. draw a short little line out and curve it around and a straight line down okay now do you see where his belly ends we want to come a little bit below that so right here And give it a little curve up. That's the top part of his leg. All right, next let's draw the bottom part. And now we're getting into his feet. Now blue, I'm going to give my blue some big claws on the bottom. So arch that line around. Another little arch, that's where a claw is going to go. And I'm going to do one more. Okay, and then he's got like triangle shaped claws. Perfect. Okay. Now let's draw his other leg. I'm going to start right here, almost where those two lines connect, and draw a diagonal line down. And then it's going to curve up and back down. It'll look similar to this leg. And then come up here. curve in like that. Now I'm going to try to make this leg a little bit shorter than this front leg because this leg is behind him. So we want to make it just a little bit shorter. And then draw his toes. I'm going to move this line just a little bit. I want that a little bit more on a diagonal. There we go. All right, next we will do his arms. And blue has kind of tiny little arms. So start right here where his neck ends. And we're going to curve out like that. Come down just a little bit and we'll give him a little elbow. And 
I just gave him two claws. Okay, and now let's draw the other arm. So we're going to start right in the middle of his shoulder area. And it almost looks like a crooked letter J. That looks really good. All right, now what makes blue special is he has a blue stripe that goes down his body. So let's go up here by his eye. And we are going to draw that blue detail that he has that makes him blue. And this line doesn't really have to be straight. It actually can be a little curvy. It's going to go all the way down his body and end it right there at the base of his tail. End it right there. Now let's do that same line on his tail, but make sure you see where this top line starts. You want to come below that. And that same line all the way to the end of his tail. And then come below this line right here and we'll connect it. All right, that looks good. Now it's color. Blue looks so good. Now it's time to open our treasure chest. Oh, look, it's Mario. And he's reading a book. Join me next time and we'll draw him too. Have a great day.